West Michigan medical professionals and medical supplies are making daily trips to Haiti. They are traveling on planes and with pilots from the Amway Corporation. 24 Hour News 8's Tony Taliavia was at the hangar today. He's at the live desk now to fill us in. Tony? Sue and Brian, the first flight left and already made it back to Grand Rapids yesterday. Another took off today, and more are planned for every single day this week. The mission primarily is to get medical supplies and medical personnel down there. It's a healthy mix of all. You know, we have nurses, doctors, uh, surgeons, physicians, assistants, you name it. They're, uh, they're lining up to come down there, so and they need them all down there, from what we can understand. The boxes going with them to Haiti include Amway products and medical supplies put together by international aid, including sterile gloves and vaccines. A lot of shots, a lot of tetanus. Amway chief pilot Patrick Rollins has chatted with the pilot flying down, who is Amway's director of aviation. He said there's a lot of people on the fences on the periphery. You can see them out there. The aviation director told his chief pilot he can see a lot of rubble from the air, but given the poverty people in Haiti experience, it's hard to know just how much devastation they were already dealing with. The flight's got the FAA OK to land Saturday. Priority, of course, goes to planes that, like Amways, contain medicine, medical supplies, and medical professionals. The Gulfstream jets can make the round trip without stopping for fuel. And once they get there, Rollins says they spend just about 45 minutes on the ground. The priority is to get the airplanes down there offloaded as quickly as they can because they have literally have airplanes in line to get down there. It's a challenge. Um, we'll look back down the road and look back and be very, you know, be very proud that we did this operation. Right now, we're really in the mode of just getting it done and getting it done safely and getting it done, you know, correct. Amway representatives say they were able to help get this effort together quickly because they had teams with some experience dealing with natural disasters, including Hurricane Katrina. Coming up at 545, you'll hear from someone who's expecting to get on one of those flights later this week. Back to you. Tony, thank you. And there is a way that you can help those that are suffering in Haiti. Wood TV is partnering with Spartan Stores, D&W, Family Fair, and the Salvation Army for help for Haiti. Red kettles are out across West Michigan for donations. A list of locations is scrolling at the bottom of your screen. You could also find it online at woodtv.com. The fact that